okay, not this song. Much better. Hello, my friends. Here is another MP3 player I coded using ESP32 device, of course. And for the first time we have decent speaker. There are many ESP32 boards that comes with some sort of speaker, but in most cases those speakers are very quiet and tiny. So today I will present to you this WaveShare 1.85 LCD ESP32 board. Resolution of this screen is 360 by 360 and uh, like many other yes, uh, and like many other WaveShare boards it comes packed with many useful features such as real-time clock, chip, uh, accelerometer, TFT card slot, which is needed for a <laughs> 3 player, and what else? Here is also microphone inside of it, but the uh, most exciting part is uh, of course built-in audio amplifier, and fact that this board can be purchased with this speaker box. There is version with battery and version without battery of this speaker box. Uh, my version was without a battery, but I was able to install my own battery inside. I installed 500 milliamps milliamp hour battery so that should be uh, enough for a few hours of playing and there is plenty room inside so you can probably fit even a larger battery or two smaller in parallel I wanted a really basic uh, MP3 player. Here I can set song. If I press play, selected song will play. Here I have a battery voltage. And with this button I can change random song. Same function is with this boot button or button which is connected to GPIO 0. And this button is reset. If I press it, board will reset it. So this is my old playlist with songs from my childhood and that's it we will not listen to many songs this video will probably get uh, lots of copyright strikes and i will not earn a penny from it but if you want to support my work or if you want to use this code like always i will share code for this mp3 player you can find code in description and you can uh, if you want to support my work you can buy me coffee become my patreon supporter or youtube thanks there are many options i'm still working on it and i still have some ghost <laughs> touch inputs but i will find a way to fix fix it. Over a very interesting board. 
it can be used for uh, in streaming internet radio stations for mp3 players for it was it is nice to have board with better speaker it is not too large speaker so you can't ex uh, expect uh, too much bass from it but is but sound quality is uh, I don't know how to for example sound quality is same like sound quality on uh, mid-range laptops and now we can take a look and take a look inside to see what we can find inside which connectors which I see and and I will also show you how to connect this battery okay let's see what is inside usually I don't do this but probably many of you would like to see what is inside so first I will remove this speaker cover and here we can find three screws It is very easy to disassemble. I need to be careful because I am always losing those screws. And here is speaker. Here is battery my and if I remove these three spacers I can also remove this plastic case and here we can see what is inside so speaker connector battery connector yes I forgot to mention that I like this me mechanical on on off switch uh, here is also potentiometer which can also be used to set loudness of of speaker music real time clock chip accelerometer tft card slot amplifier everything is here it is very hard to s <laughs> for me to see what is what under the camera but you can find this uh, this image on Waveshare page so feel free to take a look overall very nice board I like the fact that they are they are including antenna external antenna connector I never try to use antenna that connects to this connector but I think it can improve Wi-Fi reception even more so that's it very interesting board and very different from usual boards with speakers thank you for your time tell me what you think in comments and have a great day. Goodbye.